From Edinburgh we make the short drive to Stirling. Along the way we will pass Linlithgow Palace, the birthplace of Mary, Queen of Scots. Stirling Castle has a commanding position atop a volcanic core and has played witness to many important events in Scottish history. There will be a chance to visit the castle to see the impressive Great Hall and the sumptuous Royal Palace. The views from the battlements are simply breathtaking. Alternatively, you can explore the ancient streets of Stirling's old town. We'll stop to see some hairy highland coos before entering the Loch Lomond and Trossachs National Park. This area of outstanding natural beauty will give you a real taste of the highlands. We'll drive along the banks of Loch Venacher, then enjoy the views over Loch Achray. There's more spectacular scenery as we climb over the Duke's Pass to make a stop in Aberfoyle. These are the clan lands of the famous folk hero Rob Roy MacGregor. As we travel towards Loch Lomond, you'll be entertained with stories of his many exploits. On our arrival, we'll visit the little village of Balmaha, where there will be free time to enjoy the stunning views of Loch Lomond and take a stroll along the Bonnie Bonnie Banks. Many people consider Glengoyne to be one of Scotland's most attractive whisky distilleries. Here you can enjoy a tour of the distillery to see how Scotch whisky is made using traditional methods. At the end of the tour, enjoy a tutored tasting, and for whisky fans, a visit to the shop is not to be missed. From Glengoyne, we travel through the towns and villages that sit at the foot of the sprawling Campsie Fells. Near Falkirk, we pass the impressive Kelpie's horsehead statues, then make our way back to Edinburgh. Thank you.